Hi, it's Nathan with Clark Chevrolet again, and I had a bunch of uh, people upset about my uh, living in Reynosa uh, video, and uh, I, re I had a comment, I responded uh, truthfully about uh, the crime in Reynosa that I understand, which I don't ever see anything, everybody's friend friendly and welcoming, but there was a lot of, uh, how do you say, I felt like negativity. I try to answer as positive as po as I could. And um, so I thought I would interview some people that live here, that have been here longer than me. This is uh, Irwin. And when, when, where were you born, Irwin? I was born here in Reynosa, Tamaulipas. Okay. I was born here in Reynosa, Tamaulipas. Fantastic. And can I ask you what year you were born? That way we get an idea how old you are. I am 61 years. Oh, okay. So you've lived here the majority of your life. I live where I live mm, 20, 20 years, my first 20 years here. And then I studied in Monterrey. And then I was living at Mexico City. 34 years and then I come back to my city. Okay, fantastic. So can I ask you out of all the Reynosa and Monterey and you said Mexico City, right? Yes. Did you ever feel that there was like too much crime and you were unsafe? People say that maybe in Lejanas, neighborhoods far away from here, Downtown is a security area. Uh -huh. uh, maybe in some, uh, in las orillas, how do you say in the perimeter, in the, uh, in las afueras, how do you say it? But you've never experienced anything like that in your life, right? No. Okay. I just wanted to know, because I've only lived here for three years, uh, and then some time in Leon, Guanajuato, and then a little, a really small time in Mexico City, but just wanted to, uh, you know, ask, ask some natives, you know, the people that have been born here. So what you're saying is you feel comfortable and confident, I feel confident. in Reynosa, Monterey, yes. Mexico City. Mexico City, it's the same. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you for the interview, Erwin. Thanks. <laughs> So you got it there straight from someone's lived in Mexico his whole life and uh, most of his time here. So um, let's ask some more people.